Hello everyone and welcome back to Keandra's Creations. I hope you all are staying safe during this quarantine epidemic um, with the coronavirus. Um, I've come back to show you a style that can be done during quarantine and it's finger coils and it can be done on any age. Um, if you watch my last hair tutorial, you know I love a silly Missouri products and I'll be using those along with the extreme wet line gel for this style. Uh, and this style can last uh, a week, maybe two, depending on how you maintain and care for your hair uh, at night. So I've already, this is freshly washed hair. I've sectioned her hair off and I'm just going to um, section it further to make a smaller section to work with. I'm spraying her hair with my combination of water, aloe vera juice, and uh, rose water. That was the first thing I sprayed. And then I put on the Acilla Missouri leave-in. And then I'm going to put on the Cocoa Splendor Oil. And then after that, I'm going to just make sure the products are distributed evenly through the hair. And then I'm going to go in with the Wet Line Extreme Gel. Um, and I make sure that I get the roots really, really good um, and work it from root to tip. And then I'm going to go in with the Dimming Brush again and just make sure the product is evenly distributed through her hair. Now, this is where the finger coil part comes in at. I'm sectioning the hair off in small sections and I wrap the hair around my finger and make sure I go all the way down to the ends with the hair. And I try to get the root as tightly as possible. And I'm going to uh, make sure like towards the, um, as we go in, in the video that you'll be able to see a more up close uh, look at how this, um, how I'm doing this. But all I'm doing is just wrapping the hair around my finger and as I'm doing it, I'm going down the shaft of the hair. And I've sped this video up to save time. So I'm going in again, the next section that is nothing more than 100% pure aloe vera juice with some rose water and um, water. And aloe vera juice is so moisturizing to the hair, especially in rose water. And also if you have any type of scalp irritations, that also helps to eat, to combat those irritations that you have on your scalp. Um, me and my daughters have psoriasis on our scalps and so that really helps so it's a two for one um it's getting healthier scalp and also moisturizing the hair this is the first time i have worked with the uh wet line gel this will be my first time using it so I wanted to know what all the hype was about, about this gel. So now I'm just making sure that I am getting it thoroughly worked through the hair. And trying to make sure I really get those roots taut, not tight, because you don't want a lot of puffiness when this dries.
So now this is the last um, quadrant of hair that I'm working with. And I've just gone through her whole hair head and just done the same steps all over. And I go back and forth between a wide two comb with a denim and brush. And if you hear that noise in the background, I'm sorry, that is the AC just decided to pop on while I'm doing my voiceover. And so here I am setting her under the dryer for a little while to um, start the drying process with her hair. Um, but she's not going to fully dry under the dryer. I'm going to let her air dry uh, overnight. This is the next day. And I'm adding some more of that Acilla Missouri Cocoa Spinner Oil. And the link is going to be down below is how you can order the products. Um, I just run that through her hair. And now I'm going to go through and separate these coils to make them more fluffier. Now, if she wanted to, she could have worn it like this if you just want to kind of pull on the coils and kind of elongate them even more. But we wanted a more fluffier, bigger look. She likes, she's like her mother. She loves big hair. And also with this oil that I'm using, if you see any type of white cast from the gel, the oil is going to eliminate that white cast. And no, I am not sponsored by Ocilla Missouri nor Wetline. Um, I just wanted to try the Wetline product. I bought it with my own money to see what the hype was about with it. And also, um, I just love Ocilla Missouri. I've been using the Ocilla Missouri products now since uh, 2018, I want to say. And I have just fallen in love with the products, the whole line. From the hair care to the body care. It is a black owned company. That's another reason why I love it. But um, the customer service is great. Um, it's all natural products. I can pronounce all the ingredients. So I, I love it. And our hair loves it. So now I'm just going through my Y2 comb and I'm going to pick the roots up just to see what is going on with these curls and see. Do I need to separate more? And as you see, I'm not going all the way through to the end. I'm just picking at the root.
And here I'm just spraying oil on her scalp. And then I saw there were some places where there was a little bit of residue. For the most part, I like this gel. <clears throat> um, I like the way that the coils turned out. And here I'm just styling her up. <laughs> She's sitting here singing. But um, for the most part, I did like the gel. Do I like it better than um, my Eco Styler? Eh, I don't know. Um, the jury is still out. Um, it's not terrible. Um, the hair was not extremely crunchy or anything like that. Um, it did hold a style uh, for a good while. She wore this style for about a week and a half, uh, which is pretty good for her because she is very hard on her hair. But um, I'm not going to say I'm in love with the wet line gel, but I will probably use it again. And here I am just pinning her hair up into a style. I gave her the illusion of a half up, half down with a bang. I really hope you all enjoyed this video. If it gives you an idea of a style you want to try for yourself or your little one. Um, and again, um, stay tuned. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. There's more to come. Thank you so much.